Hey Fearless Founders! Today I would like to share with you one type of marketing that will bring you results way, way faster than any other type of marketing in the world. And if you want to know what it is, then I encourage you to keep watching. The two most predominant types of marketing are direct response marketing, and this is the one that we're going to be focusing on today, and then relationship-based marketing. Now, let me be clear, I think both have a place in every business or at different stages of the business. But if you're trying to grow and you're not succeeding, you really need to focus on the direct response marketing because this one is the one that will elicit response right away, if done correctly, of course. Now, why is direct response marketing so cool? It's great because you can track it, you can measure it, it's very targeted and it speeds up results in your business. The goal of this type of marketing is getting return of your investment, whether it's money or time, really quickly. So you want the results ASAP. And the relationship-based marketing is, of course, as the name suggests, focus on building relationship first. But there are downsides to that. It takes time and cost consuming. It also has many steps. It can get very overwhelming, especially if you are new to business. And it can make you burn out very, very quickly. And it creates a really long buyer journey. Now, when should you not use direct response marketing? Definitely not in the moments when your offer isn't clear just yet. You need a super clear offer so you can communicate it very effectively to your customer. Now, in order to elicit immediate response through your content, you need a little knowledge. You need to use active voice and you need to use power words. Your call to action that you connect to your content needs to be clear, irresistible for your potential buyer, it needs to focus on one action only, so don't ask people to do two things at the same time, it's gonna confuse them, just one thing at a time, and it also needs to be personalized. So another thing that we need to introduce is little urgency. Our brain will always try to protect us from taking uncomfortable action. So if we don't have to spend the money right now, we're gonna go on that holiday that we planned, or maybe even not, we're gonna get spontaneous trip, we're gonna go on that date, we're gonna think about making food or maybe going for a walk. And no, I don't mean the walk that actually helps you with your health. I mean that little destructive voice that always tells you to do something different that you actually need to do, that you know you need in order to get results fast. Introducing a little urgency will make your potential buyer to act right now a little faster than they normally would because they're afraid they're not gonna get what they want. The last thing that you need is you need to connect a custom personalized offer with your direct response marketing. Now, why custom? We live in an era with incredibly high competition and it's not a bad thing. It's great for the customer because they have a lot of choice, but it can be paralyzing as well. So in order to entice your customers or your prospects to buy from you, you need to create something more custom, something that will send out. And it is proven by research, in fact, up to 80% of people said that given the choice, they would prefer to buy from a company or a brand that offered something custom. It just shows how big of a chunk of a market there is for grabs. I hope you enjoyed today's content and if you did, please let me know in the comments below by stating which part of the video did you find the most helpful.